students in this video we will be learning about DNA there are millions and billions of living species on the face of the earth they all have DNA as their genetic material DNA also has information about features and functions of an organism encoded in its functional unit gene deoxyribonucleic acid was discovered by Johannes Friedrich Major who was a Swiss physician and biologist in 1869 he discovered DNA while studying phosphorus and nitrogen rich content from the nuclei of white blood cell in pus in 1953 dr james watson and francis crick proposed the double helical structure of dna for which they received nobel prize nucleotide is the building block of a dna it is made up of a phosphate molecule deoxyribose sugar and a nitrogenous base there are four types of nitrogenous bases adenine thymine guanine and cytosine adenine always pairs with thymine and they are joined with a weak hydrogen double bond whereas guanine always bonds with cytosine with the help of a triple hydrogen bond these pairs of nitrogenous bases are known as base pairs imagine dna as a spiral staircase the rung of the staircase is made up of the nitrogenous base and the side rails are made up of phosphate and sugar molecule a segment or part of this dna with a specific sequence of nucleotide is known as gene dna is present in the chromatin which is inside the nucleus of a cell DNA constitutes about 40% of chromatin the remaining 60% of chromatin is a protein called histone which provides support DNA is wrapped around a core of 8 histone and this unit is known as a nucleosome Millions of nucleosomes coil extensively to form a chromatin which condenses to form chromosome at the time of cell division. There are about 3 billion base pairs found in 46 chromosomes of a human cell. 99% of base pairs in humans are the same. But analyzing the remaining 1% a person can be uniquely identified. That's all for now. Hope you found this video useful. Please do like, share and subscribe. See you soon. Bye-bye.